Now the top six is time for the next competition. Earlier in the game, a legacy advantage was implanted into the competition. Um, it was hidden, a player found it, and if a player was evicted, they had to pass it to someone of their choice. Who did they give it to? I just saw last time, Hans had the legacy advantage and gave it to Noah. So Noah, I now ask that you open that envelope. Can I just break it? Yep. Yeah. Oh, okay. That was in his pants. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that's his bro's being dudes, come on. <laughs> The final six head of household. All right, so congratulations, Noah. You are head of household for the second time in a row. <laughs> I just made history. You just made history. Congratulations. And you can't compete next week? And you cannot compete next week. All right, so get ready for nominations. Oh, my God. Wow. Uh, does, it, does anybody want to go first? Rip, Hans. Oh, I'm Pete. Oh, I'm Pete. Oh, I'm Pete. Oh, I'm Pete. Welcome back. Welcome to our podcast. Um, this is called How to Win Big Brother without even trying. Hey, even shut up. We've been trying this whole time. Trying so hard. Okay, so. So we got Hans out, which is a you, good okay, move. Final four. Do you want to pour that in my mouth? Oh my god, this is erotic. <laughs> he said no. He said no eating, but he didn't say anything about drinking. <laughs> Be more specific next pull, time. Pull some shots in here, just go bip, bip. I'm trying to be hammered for this final. <laughs> We're going to walk in falling. No, I know. Um, He's going to be really mad, too, because I just moved the camera a lot. That's okay. I mean, but, um, that's going to be hard. Yeah. I kind of <laughs> didn't want it, but <laughs> it is what it is. Obviously, yeah. Oh, we'll just put the two up. Can you just put them two up? Her and Laura? Yeah. Yeah, that's just... Unless you want to... Can you just put them two up? They know it's coming. Right? We have to. Hey, Laura, you have to get her out this time. Dude, you know it's true. No, 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 no. She's an asshole. You just want to go again? You want her out last round? Let's just finish this. Yeah, do it. Just finish this. I wanted Laura out. I want to just finish. I just want to go to sleep. I'm not going to get you out. No! I don't know, you said you want to go sleep. No, stop, that's not funny. <laughs> you can't do that to me. I'm I'm in it. I'm in it to the end. You know okay. that. Or just I'll go I'll gun it for the beat and make sure they don't get in. That's all I'm gonna do that again. As bad as that is. <laughs> I feel so bad. I don't know. She went up five times. I'll tell you all these straws. I mean you whoever it is is gonna be safe, regardless. What do you mean, Zoe? Oh, my okay. gosh. She's going out. I think if you put me up, I won't go home. Who would let you out? I don't know. I just feel like I'm going to Josh. What? Josh. Patrick. Who knows? <laughs> Maybe y'all can change your mind. Then it's, what, two to two if that, and then I get them right to the time, it's game over. For her, not you. Maybe it depends if you mean or not. Hey. No, but uh, I'm not going to do it, so I just need to figure out who else. Okay. And if nobody wants to volunteer, then... I'm going to just write a number down, 1 through 20, and whoever's whoever the furthest. Because I'm not picking. I'm not picking between people. You do whatever you want. I'll support you. To the end. Promise? Promise. Okay. Noah. I'm fucking scared. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Noah never think, had a conversation. I think yeah, this I is kind of I think I said I think he's tied with Laura than we think, mm -hmm. which is 
nerve wracking. But I went to the Lord and be like, <laughs> yeah. save me. <laughs> yeah, right. Because Laura oh, still has her veto. Oh, shit. Laura still has your veto. Oh, oh, She's not going to use it, though. Not if it doesn't get up. It's honestly not that. Oh, that's so Who's it going to be besides me again? <laughs> <laughs> I feel, like he might, I feel like he's gonna throw one of us three up and just say fight for Vito. Like, I don't think he's gonna be tough. I think he yeah. is. I think he's gonna definitely turn against each other. I can see that. I can see that. I, can see that. I mean, that'd be smart for him because I think we're gonna focus on each other and we're gonna focus on him. Yeah. Because he can't play next week. And, like, he's, he's not worried. He's from back to back HOHs, you know? Yeah. Like, How is he always HOH? I don't. He, he literally never won one and then he won two in a row. Right. In, like, the most important time. I uh, know. Yeah. The most important literally, time. Literally. Seven and six are so big. Yeah, I'm actually like really worried this round. Yeah. I, it's all about because it really could be anybody. I know, but, it's yeah. like, but like think about it. We're at six, right? So if he wins and he puts up like let's say me and you, someone wins he all pulls me off. He has like no options. So we He's, we maybe we can put up somebody. But then, like, what if another veto gets played? And and then oh my god, right? This could get messy. This could get really interesting. I feel like. Us plus Emily would be a strong Really? Against Laura and Emily? Against Laura and Emily. But the thing is, the thing is, with HOH right now, she has mm -hmm. she has veto power. We have no power, you know? And Emily's talking to him right now. So Maybe I'm Get him. her to come over here and like, let us know what you're thinking. I'm definitely going to go in there and be like, what are you thinking? Like, I, I just, I, I'm going to be like, do you want to make Laura use your advantage? Like, because yeah. we can. We can. It would be hard. Would and the like, chances are you could save her. You could save her anyway. I don't know, it's just, it's just like Final Six is literally like a game of inches. Yeah. And like I, literally. I know. What's that? So. Alright, what you thinking? Silent, put up Dylan. Can't not. And then out of us, I, hopefully someone wants to step up and then if not, like I said, I'm going to pick a number. And whoever's the first number. I mean, I, cause I don't want to pick anybody. Okay. And we didn't volunteer? Fuck. Okay. Um, I mean... Again, I know I have the votes with Emily and Patrick, and you. Would we'll break the tie. Could wait. It would be. No, no. What do you mean tie? What do you mean tie? Oh, yeah, she's going. We need to get her. She can't float all the way to the front. No. Yeah, it's her time. I, I'm gonna hope somebody else because you did it last time. Well, yeah, and somebody. I'll do it again because yeah. I don't care. Like, I'm gonna hope somebody else does that. So let me talk to him. But I mean, Patrick might. But I mean, if nobody else, else, if nobody else does, I don't care. But she's going. I know I have Emily, Patrick, and your vote. Yeah, for sure. All right. All right. Who's next? Oh, sure. That made it easy. What? She got my hair. My suspicions. That's me and Josh. I feel like I feel like we're the ones. I just talked to him and he said he's gonna have a straw of straws. Are you serious? Because he's so indecisive. Yeah. I know. Like it's it's scary. Like yeah, it's something yeah, else. Yeah. It's like. Um, <clears throat> is he really having straw straw? Yeah. Draw? No, he doesn't have a straw straw. I'm going to make y'all write numbers down and then guess and number and whoever's closest to the numbers. There's so many things that can go happen because, especially with Laura's power. But like, I, I really have no idea, so just like go in there and talk to him because like he's literally about to make us just big numbers. So. Yeah, got gotcha. you. Yeah. But I'm more worried about what happens next round when I can't play. Yeah. Because you can't. I can't compete. Right. Very true. So, I mean, I'm good in your eyes. Yeah. If you sure. win, I'm not touching the block right. Right, for sure. Okay. I'm trying to keep the four that we said. Okay. That's what I was about. Yeah, okay. I just want to make sure. And if you hear anything out there yeah, that I, I got hear, just come up here. Mm -hmm. I got you. Sure. You mean send me in the next one? Yeah, yeah. Okay. My man. You <laughs> really a lucky son of a bitch. Huh? Me or you? Me. I was gonna say, I think I'm lucky because you've been talking about getting the ass since the beginning, but yeah, I've been able to Tom. Really? Are you ready for it? Can you get that reaction face to face? Are you ready? No, I'm not. Okay. So stop joking. That's not even funny. You think you're funny? I'll put them jail in. No, no. Here's what makes it easy though. Laura said it. Nobody else nominates herself. I can put her. And she. Yes. So that's kind of good though, because I literally love the idea of playing two videos. I just think that's kind of clown. No, she doesn't want to play two videos. She just wants me to nominate us so we can vote out Jillian, and she thinks she'll be safe. She just said, you can put me up on the block, let's go, I trust you. So I mean, that kind of makes it easy. This is insane. I'm okay with that though. I'm going with Jillian, y'all. Okay. I have no shit with that. Now, you, you're going to go for that. 
Hey, so age. Dude, I, would, I was literally, th I was like, no, I was gonna win immunity, because that's what I thought the legacy advantage was. When he gave it to you, I was like, damn, dude. I was like, good play on your end. Um, you're gonna get immunity. I vote, I nominated him, he gave it to me. Dude, don't even and I told, read me that. And I told I was every like, single person in the house that he had for me. I don't know, but I was so sure. I was like, okay, so no, I have immunity. So, me and Laura are gonna for HOA. Honestly, anybody could come for HOA. Laura has two vetoes, you know, so we could have. I was gonna make it better. What? For when you were the next HOA. Easy. Cool. And then you're gonna win the last one? It's a it's cakewalk, homie. I hope so. It's a cakewalk. We're definitely the two biggest competition threats. I don't know how we made it this far. If it's anything physical, we got it. So, alright, well, let me finish talking to the you. <sighs> I'm so happy. I'm so happy. I can't believe you know me. I can't believe she volunteered herself. That is crazy. Top six. She said, I trust you. I respect, I respect the trust. She's a good ally. Why weren't we working with her in the beginning? I have. Well, there you go. Look at that. It all comes full circle. That's what you told me. Good. Because if you would have told you something different, then I would have freaking out. No, you told me the exact same thing. And we're banking on Final Four. Easy. That, that, that's I'm what, literally that's not even worried about it. I think. Okay, wait, also, whenever the war was in here, she said that she, that this is the last time that she can use her veto, but I don't know if that's true or not. I think it is, because the other ones have been Final Six. Because mm -hmm. I know I saw, someone told me about Josh's, and they said it was Final Six. Mm -hmm. and, then, and then whenever, whenever Emily used hers on my HOH to give you the power, I was like, how long could you use that? She was like, I could have used it to final six. So I think they all coincide to like final six. Final six. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Oh. I respect you. <laughs> What's up? It's good. Still shook. So who are you putting out besides me? <laughs> <laughs> Just cut to the chase. <laughs> who would you like to sit by? Like that's so... Uh, either Laura or Josh, I guess. Okay. And I, I won't tell anybody you told me yeah. that you said that. But if you put up Laura, she's going to use her. her but that's okay, because if you don't win, it, that gives you an extra chance exactly, to try so to like, win. It's it. really down to this game. Yeah. 100%. So you're, you're cool with Laura? Yeah. Okay. And I mean, I already assumed yeah. it was going to be. I just, at this point. I mean, it's the name of the game. You might as well this just, is the new, like. It's the new vibe. Yeah, espionage? No. Julian? <laughs> It's, yeah. And at least you'll get to compete in the power video. Yeah, like, we'll see what happens. I'm so All right, final party. six, it is time for the nomination ceremony. Noah, deja vu. Uh, it's crazy, uh, man. It's pretty crazy. You broke the laws of the brother, and you are HOH for the second week in the round. So it is now your turn to nominate two parties for eviction again. Go ahead. Well. Julian, why did you take a seat? Why didn't you sit there in the beginning? Laura, will you please have a seat up there? Alright, yet again, Julian and Laura, you are arms with rock. Laura, do you have anything to say? I mean, I just want to see Julian compete again and win. And, uh, and then have to compete again. And then it doesn't have to compete again. So, yeah, let's have some fun. Alright. Um, so with that, let's go to the veto ceremony. Six of you remain, so everyone can be. Let's go to the kitchen. So, here's how this will go. I am literally just going to be rattling off facts and tales and little bits about the FBI <laughs> and espionage. Um, yeah. And then you're going to take a quiz. I'm going to be in the library. Um, you have to bring me the quiz to check. The first person to get them all right wins. If you get something wrong, I will give it back to you. I will not tell you what is incorrect. You'll have to come back here and change it. During the Cold War, we partnered with several other US and British intelligence agencies in a 37 year effort to decrypt, decode, and exploit messages sent by Soviet intelligence. This was known as the Venona Project. Dumpster diving, the practice of rooting through company or individual's trash, can provide foreign and economic spies with valuable information that could have been discarded more carefully. Fun fact. <laughs> Velva Lee Dickinson owned a doll shop on Madison Avenue in New York during World War II. 
She passed information about the conditions of U.S. warships to Japan in phony letters that ostensibly, ostensibly talked about collectible dolls. We estimate that American companies lose tens of billions of dollars a year to foreign competitors that have deliberately targeted their economic intelligence. <laughs> we have to here. You have five incorrect. You have four incorrect. Oh, that's better than her. You have two incorrect. Yeah, you have four incorrect. You have four incorrect. Four? What? What? You have five incorrect. Right. It's just goes right here, right now. <laughs> you could look reading this. <laughs> no, you're trash. There's no way. Noah wins the video. Oh! Are you kidding oh, me? Yeah. I'm not kidding you. <laughs> Who said Noah was smart? Me. This had nothing to do with knowledge. No, if you were only with the head, <laughs> the two hands. Yes. Uh, as you prepare for the veto ceremony, also prepare for an eviction ceremony. We're gonna yeah. just go just straight over. Down, yeah. Okay, so talk and get ready for a vote. I'm gonna go in my room. Yeah, I stopped listening all over it. I didn't listen. Like, at all. <laughs> I literally was just copying people. Like, there was no, there was no, and there I didn't was even no effort. I was like, we got for six. Bam. Give it to me. Yeah. So. No, I didn't even try, so. Yeah. I'm keeping the same. Same So, so Jillian out. Uh, and then you or Emily needs to win to keep. Us to be safe. Yeah. So, I guess we're all going to do this round. Yep. Unless you're red. <laughs> I mean, I think it's about time she's done floating. Yeah. I mean, unless, you have unless I don't know, because it's either between Laura and Jill. Yeah, because I wouldn't plan on this. Yeah. Because I don't know when does Laura's veto. This round. It ends in this round. Yeah. So she can't use it this round? Mm -hmm. or she's oh. done. It's expired. Wait, why do we get her out? If anything, who has more machines than Laura and Jillian? Laura and Jillian. Yeah. But at the same time, we don't want to float her. I'll float her because Laura volunteered to vote yeah. there, so y'all didn't have to, so we could vote out Jill. Gill, me, Jillian. Yeah. Yeah. So I, that's my only thing for her. She was like, look, I don't want anybody else to do it. I'll go do it for y'all. Yeah. So I would feel like shit. Yeah, I see what you mean. So. I see what you mean. To me, yeah. I would rather just get the person out that's been on lock all year. So, I don't know if you're okay with that. No, I mean, it's whatever you want to do. Okay. I'm, I'm following whatever you want to do. All right, bro. So, are you judging? I mean, I don't get to vote. So, if y'all decide, oh, not too bad. Yeah, it's up to y'all. Yeah, but, yeah. like, I would. Shit, shit, shit. I don't know. Just talk. Let me know. Okay. I mean, you know, or the other one's getting on next. So. You need, you, need to get, you need to win that HRH. Oh, yeah, because you. I can't. You can't do it. Yeah, true. Sure. Put the team on your back, though. You remember the pinky promise? Hmm? You remember the pinky promise? Yeah. Are you. Hmm? I think. But if I'm not saying it, I mean, I haven't talked to him yet, but I'm pretty sure it's a little more going on. I don't really know how we put it. That's what my thoughts are. I just want to know if you'll vote for me if it comes down to it. Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, I want to hear more than her. Yeah, same. I fuck for more than her. Yeah, that's Cool. Thanks a lot. Okay. Alright. Are you going to keep them the same? I mean... That's fine. Unless I hear something crazy. No, keep them the same, that's fine. No, I'm saying unless I hear like, we want Laura or something crazy, which I haven't so far because I'm the single person. And yeah, Patrick, keep the same. Yeah, Patrick is keeping yeah. me, obviously. And then why don't you go win that next HOH, man? I'm gonna and try. And then we can make I'm gonna try. And we'll make a real proof. Good? Good. All right, go. If it comes to being Laura. So, I want to go for Laura. I think she's a threat. Definitely. But I don't know what, what they're feeling. I'd rather, I'd rather go around with them because I feel like she's been around for a while. Like, I've always peeped around, like, ever since James was around. Mm -hmm. I want to vote her out, but I also don't want to put a target on my back and go against the majority. That's why I'm trying to find out what the majority is, but I'd rather, I'm trying to, I told, uh, I told Noah, I said, I want to vote Laura out. And Noah doesn't have a say on what happens because, you know, you can't vote. Yeah. But I do want Laura out for sure. Okay. For sure. Yeah. For sure. Let's move. I think you're in for a big move here. No, we can vote. Not this round. Mm -hmm. um, and the next round, if you win, you need to win. But the thing is, even if I, 
idea. I'm gonna gun for it because why would I throw it? It's way too late in the game to throw it. Yes. Yes. That's fine. I don't care so, about that. But if one of them win, I mean, you're going to walk. I know, and I'm okay with that because I know it won't be against you, it'll be against Laura. Yeah. I want Laura to go. I'm sorry. I want Laura Josh gone. I trust you and Emily. You know, we were like the three that started it, I think. I, just, I, I, know, I know Emily's the biggest threat, but like, uh, I think us three are the biggest threat. I don't want. But I don't know where Emily's head's at in terms of final three. Right. And final two. I, I trust Emily more than I trust Josh to like take me anywhere. Yeah, right. But I also don't trust Josh for I buy oh. also like, if I maybe if I win HOH, I'll tell you who I'm putting up right now. I'm putting up Laura and I'm putting up Josh. Okay. Because I want Josh. I want Josh because I'm sure that can be Laura. Hands down in the final HOH conversation. Alright. If we can't do that then we don't start doing the game. Whereas, if Emily wins, I don't know which takes you, I don't want to even change it. I don't mean you win, or will you win against Laura and just run it. You think Laura's weaker than comps than Emily? Really? Laura's? I feel like Laura's just let us judge it off this next competition. Bet. Bet. Right. Whoever finishes better, I'm down. Okay. Because it doesn't matter, but you want to, you're my friend. Honestly, you're my too. I you fucked me up. Really, my slashing tires at the end of this game. I did drive here, so it's okay. That doesn't. Okay. You want to run the ball? Fat. Kinda. Do you really want me to? No! No, shut the fuck up. You're such a clown. I mean, by that logic, why not just take Josh? Josh has a one day. Let's go, right? Okay. Yeah. You're good? Yeah, we're good. Yeah. I mean, by that logic, why not put up more? I would do that. Josh, I'll take Josh. He put 10 seconds for his time back in and barely ran to a tree. We beat the fuck out of him in the competition, me and you, and then we go. Yeah. Okay. That's actually the best. That's actually the best. Bet. I know, I agree, because I think I will be able to swing it like, oh, Emily. Like, I don't want you to think that, like, I don't think we're working together. Yeah, like, so far. Honestly. And you're right, Emily could win the competition. Yeah. All right, house guests. It's time. All right, you guys. I'm right here. Here we go. That's part of the jacket. Okay, let's go. I'm like, all right, let's go. All right. It is time for the final six veto and eviction ceremony. Keep going. Um, Noah, you have won the power of veto. You have the power to save either Laura or Jillian from the block. What you gonna do? Just put it in my pocket. Not use it. All right. Noah has decided not to use the power of veto, which means, Laura and Jillian, you are this round's final nominees. At the end of this ceremony, one of you will be evicted. However, before your fellow house guests get the chance to vote to evict, you will each have one last opportunity to speak your mind and plead your case to stay in the game. Um, Jillian, you're first. Day one, day two, day two, I think. Week 17. <laughs> <laughs> you know me and I know you. We follow each other on Instagram. Yeah, we do. We do. That's, that's they knew each other before this game. I had faith in you guys. I didn't know one last time. Oh, wow. That was so That would have been most emotional. I think that was it. That was the one. Alright. Give it to us. House guests, uh, like I said in my last speech, uh, it's getting to the point where everyone has to do what's best for their game. Um, I personally think keeping me is going to be the best for your game because Jillian seems to be floating right to the finals. Um, she, in my opinion, she hasn't built working relationships with many people, and I think the reason why she's been nominated like 10 times at this point is because she's the <laughs> easiest person to throw up because she's not aligned with anybody. Um, don't let a floater get to the finals. Go for the stronger competitor. That's me. Thank you. Right. Again, I'm going to have to cut somebody that I would totally take to the final two because they would totally take me to the final two. And I could throw a vote away and claim that I'm trying to, you know, like keep Emily and Josh off the fact that I'm working with Noah, but I don't want to go to the final with Noah. I, I can beat Emily. 
go to the final three with Josh, if he champs wins, or if Emily gets cold feet about taking me because she, she thinks I can beat her, which I can beat her. Confidence, woohoo. That has nothing to do with my vote. I'm gonna vote to evict Gilligan. Great, thank you. Hello, Josh. Who do you vote to evict? I'm voting Laura. Okay. You're looking great today, Taylor. You changed your shoes? Yeah, this was like a, a 1 p.m. development. Oh, I'm so sorry, I didn't know. No, you're okay. All right, hello, Emily. Hey. Who do you vote to evict? Um, I vote to evict. Why do I keep saying? <laughs> you keep saying it. I know it's I'm going story. crazy. I vote to evict. That was really aggressive. Sorry. I vote to evict Lauren. Wait. Laura. <laughs> we'll give you a good take. Good take. Good take. <laughs> Let's try it. Let's try it. <laughs> so sorry. I vote to evict Laura. Once I announce the result of the vote, the evicted house guest must say her goodbyes, pack up her belongings, walk out this door, and have an exit interview with Holly. Ooh! By a vote of two to one, Laura, you have been evicted from the big house. Thank you for playing.